Hey everyone and welcome. Again, I apologize if the sound is a bit low. You guys can turn on the captions for English subtitles. So Texas Pro Classic Physique is in the history books. When we were heading into Texas Pro, the classic physique battle between Logan Franklin and Steve Laureus was the most hyped up thing in classic. No one expected that Robert Thames will return to stage with the best shape of his career and steal the show. Logan was definitely bigger, 6 pounds heavier to be precise than his Olympia 2020 package, but it's clear that he is far from being an Olympia threat until he pushes his weight cap. Robert's legs came up tremendously since the last time he competed at the Olympia 2018 where he placed 15th, and from the time he took the stage, he presented himself with great confidence and it was a clear-cut victory. And if it said that Robert slid the competition, it would be true. Logan was spot on in regards to conditioning and his posing was as classic as it gets. But when you look at his physique, it's pretty evident that he still lacks muscle density in certain areas. And Chris Bumstead's coach, Ian, was 100% right that he needs to get into the top 6 first before he can start calling out one of the most dominant champions of this division. Credit should be given where it's due. We should admire the judging panel for giving the nod to Robert Thames over Logan Franklin because Logan is way more active on social media and he had a much bigger fan base than Robert who never posts on his IG. Let me remind you something about Robert Thames that he was placed 6th in the first ever Classic Physique Olympia while working with Dennis James back in 2016. And DJ predicted that if his legs came up, he can be a top 3 guy in the future. The most disappointing performance came from Steve Laureus who did improve from last showing but still ended up in third. He only looks a shadow of what he presented at the On Classic 2019 which was worthy of challenging anyone in the top 3 of the Olympia. Steve's shape is so beautiful and aesthetic that this is one of the major reasons he is making the first call out and beating guys with better conditioning. It's a shame though we won't be able to see both these guys Logan and Steve at the Olympia this year. Hit the thumbs up button if you like the video and smash the subscribe button if you wanna come back for more. Thank you.